Level up your creativity, your printer, your productivity, and your business with the new Canon Colorado M-Series printer. Multiple versions of the new Canon Colorado, six to be exact. But it is a highly modular system. Customers can create their own custom printer and can add features that they do not need now later. You can order the version you want and then add on additional features as you need them. There is a 10% roughly premium for upgrading later versus purchasing outright, but at least you have it configured the way you want it without a bunch of features that you never use and you really shouldn't have to pay for. Now the printer models come in six variants but it's essentially variants on three main bases. We begin with the base model, the M3. Yeah, I, I kind of suspect they borrowed it from BMW, but it is clever. You remember it, right? Canon has structured this a little bit like you order a car or a truck. You purchase a combination of what you need, weighed out by what you can afford, but unlike a vehicle, this printer has almost a full upgrade path from any point. Now, M3 is entry level. That's basic features only, but it can be upgraded. Basic features are still fantastic. I mean, it has all of the core features of UV gel technology, but the ink bottles are a bit smaller, 700 milliliters. The carriage is a tad slower, and it only has one roll in the tray. It is gloss only. This is the printer if you have a key application that can justify purchasing the printer, like vehicle wraps or adhesive vinyl or even wall covering, banner, but you're on a budget. M3W is the base model plus white ink added. Very simple. M3 Pro is next up and it adds a few things. Dual roll trays, matte and gloss ink options, and double-sided printing. Inks are still 700 milliliter. M3W Pro is the M3 Pro, but white ink included. The M5 Pro has all the features Canon offers. That is the flagship printer. It has faster speed, one liter inks, dual roll tray, and the Flex Finish Plus. It's everything you want in a printer except one thing. The M5W Pro, W adds, yes, you probably guessed it again, white ink to the already decked out M5 Pro. All the things on it is the M5W Pro. That's all the features plus white ink. So effectively, there are three base models and then a white ink option for each model. Okay, we went through the models. So let's get down to why you're probably watching this. Yes, Canon has introduced a UV gel white ink, and it is very good, very, very good. Canon has a chemistry edge. The UV gel composition gives the white ink several key advantages over the other white ink alternatives on the market. The titanium dioxide pigment suspends far better in UV gel than in other ink chemistries. And as a result, it resists ink sedimentation. The Canon UV gel does not easily collapse into clumps of nozzle clogging goo the minute your back is turned. Combine this superior ink chemistry with a world-class circulation system to keep the ink moving unattended and you have white ink that performs and behaves just like CMYK inks do. The Colorado white is brilliant white with excellent opacity and superb scratch and scuff resistance. No heat from the lamps, no deformation of the media, and you can print on the widest selection of media choices. The white ink is drama-free operation and drama-free maintenance as a result of UV gel white ink suspension chemistry and top flight circulation system. UV gel white can be applied in any configuration or mode you choose. White first, white second, three layer and five layer. Any effect or combination is available. The only thing is the white ink always prints matte. I'm gonna share a little 
insider secret with all of you. Some of you already know this. All 1.6 meter white ink printers have one thing in common. They're all painfully slow when printing white ink. All of them, but not the Canon Colorado. This is the first white ink printer at this width that can be called fast. Now this is white ink fast, remember, not fast, white ink fast. I think it is fair to categorize the Colorado as a production white ink printer, not a novelty white ink printer. I encourage you to see the Colorado white ink prints at quoted speeds and density levels for yourselves. On average, I think you will see comparable or superior quality to the competition at matching density, but at two and three times the speed. Another meaningful difference between Canon and the competition is a marked difference in the total cost of ownership advantage between Canon UV gel and other ink technology. Printing CMYK on the Canon UV gel is already far more economical than competitive technology because UV gel is pinned to the media and then cured in the following step, not cured in the same point where the ink lands on the substrate. Pinning allowed Canon engineers to separate the print zone from the curing zone, and that allows for far less ink to be used to achieve ideal density. How much less? Canon research suggests 30 to 40% less than latex resin or competitive UV LED. That is a huge savings in total cost ownership just for CMYK. White ink savings on the UV gel is even more pronounced. 50 to 70% reductions in white ink use. You can save a lot of money with a Canon Colorado when running white ink because it uses so little of it to achieve ideal density targets. And for those of you who are a little new to the white ink party, white ink jobs can use three times as much CMYK because you need so much of it to create the opacity buildup. The savings on white ink add up immediately. If you have a big white ink flow now, I can probably get close to saving you the total cost of the Colorado in about a year. There is one print head for each color, five heads total, and Canon expects longer life and more durability with this current generation of Canon head technology. It's still 1800 DPI with a variable drop and all Canon manufacturing. It prints room temperature LED, which means no media deformation, even with thin and temperature sensitive medias. Now, there are some additional features as well. Canon has made five meaningful upgrades and advances to the printer. I mentioned the print heads already, but now I wanna mention also there's a new chiller. The chiller helps keep the platen really dialed in at target temperatures. The new chiller is more modular and is easier to work with. There's also a new tissue cassette. The cassette offers more ease of use and reduces operator maintenance, and it offsets the cost of this with ink savings. It is a plus financially for the user with less really to fuss about. There's also an aerosol filter upgrade. Now already the most fastidious UV printer on the market for safety and operator health, the Colorado gets even better with a new aerosol filter that captures UV aerosol and places it where it is intended to go. It is safely enclosed. Everything on this printer is safely enclosed. Canon always gets top marks for ensuring the health of the operator and the environment both take center stage. The new Colorado offers faster color calibration. It's about half the time to do a new media calibration. This is critical because Canon has legendary color uniformity and consistency. The Canon Colorado remains the defining technology in the high volume commercial 1.6 meter space. And this new white ink, it just places it further out ahead of the competition. It is the finest printer of its type with the most innovative technology package in the industry right now, in my opinion. Canon UV gel has again made a statement in the market. Thank you.